Okay, we're gonna run this uh, 150 milliamp battery until the Lucifer servos fail at uh, low voltage. Starting out the radio shows 4.21. Okay, we're almost eight minutes in. Still at four volts. We're moving. Just over 10 minutes in, 11 minutes in. Uh, holding around 3.9. This is with moving. Surfaces pretty constantly for the last 11 minutes. Okay, coming up on 15 minutes. Under load. Battery starting to drop down into 3.8, 3.7 range. <clears throat> Surprisingly, getting 15 minutes out of a 150 battery. 3.8, 4, 3.7, under load. Still moving fairly rapidly. No issues with centering. Battery's popping back up to 3.8 when uh, stop moving stuff. 20 minutes. Still holding load at uh, 373. At uh, 21 and a half minutes, starting to see voltage drop down into the 368 range. Okay, maybe not. It did once. There we go, 368. So. Later on, still moving. Starting to get down to 3682 where I have my normal low voltage warning. Servos are still moving as fast as I can go though. So, still good at 362. Coming up on 30 minutes. Starting to drop below 362. See still plenty of movement there. Thirty one minutes holding it under load at three five seven, still moving fast. Now holding steady at three four six, still moving. Starting to get a lot of chatter now though. Oh, there they just went. No more. 352. They must have dropped below a, a point. Battery's not uh, bouncing back up. So around 35 somewhere. 3534. Interesting to note the MKS are also dead at this point. So. My guess would be we're still getting an RSI from the uh, receiver though. So the receiver's still working, but no servos. MKS or Bluebird. A1 critical. About 33 and a half minutes maybe. So there we have it. The Supercell 150 milliamp to 30 minute plus. Two MKS. Two Bluebird D4R2 receiver with telemetry enabled. Pretty, pretty good for 150 milliamps though.